Hello, everybody. I think I'm ready to get started. So, we paused right on the final dungeon. I imagine it's gonna take somewhere between an hour and hour 30 minutes. Purely based off of boss RNG. I'm hoping it's closer to the one hour mark, but we'll see. But yeah, we have a somewhat annoying labyrinth to go through. And there are a lot of one-way exits, so I will be pausing every now and then to take a look at where I am in the routing. It's very important I pick up Shield 4 midway through this dungeon, or else I'm in for a very bad time <laughs> with the end of the game. The end of the game is essentially not winnable if I do not pick up this item. So, wish me luck. I think we could go ahead and pause the music. And we are going to try to get to the end of this game. I'm still not feeling all that great, but I think I can beat the game. Oh yeah, it's it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> like I almost feel like if there was a if there was a mod here, I would be like, could we please start a poll on how many times in a row I'm gonna miss a crit? I want to I want to know. We had 14. We had 14 at one point. 14 run commands in a row missed and a 25% chance to activate. So my hopes for this going smoothly are uh, in the negatives. <laughs> so I'm just going to assume everything's going to take 20 minutes longer than it should for no reason. Okay. So. I have a lot of money. I'm not going to spend any of it. I could, if I'm really desperate, I could go back. 21 revive should be more than enough. I have three safety cures. I should be able to get through this dungeon. So we're going to leave Smite as number one with the sword. I'm just denoting where the boss is in the run. Okay. So let's proceed forward. This way. Don't dwaddle or I'll leave you behind. So we're going to finally take advantage of Vanish in a little bit, but let's go through a little bit of story. Well, Kotetsu, I haven't seen you in a while. This was, must have been bad. You must be joking. I was collecting lots of stuff for you. Huh? Who is it? Oh. Oh no, my protege. Remember him well. Anyway, I brought good stuff. Your favorites. Bufufu too. What? Bufufu? Show me! I don't know what Bufufu is. It's hard to work under a guy like that. Why don't you join the hackers? What? What now? I don't know. Do it yourself. Okay. So. Well, number one. I get to the other side here. We're gonna go up here. I believe I need to become a mouse here. Ooh, why am I? I really dislike that my items get so unorganized when I play. That really bothers me. We're gonna go through the little mouse hole. <laughs> I investigated by accident. I really don't need any other items. I did not even bother looking them up. I'm like, listen, uh, the only thing I need to know where is shield for it. That's it. Did you hear? The ruler brought the princess to Choco here. They soldier, eh? Choco couldn't stop the hackers. The ruler rules. Haha, <laughs> get it? Uh, well... Where will the next attack be? Probably Quinton X next. I hear it will be soon. Too bad. A little planet like that can't compete with the fortress. Hacker soldiers. Intruder in the fortress. All personnel. Red alert. Off they go. Alright. So. How Vanish works. And why I'm going to take a safety save right now. It has a internal timer. I cannot see this timer. If at any point this item lingers on me for too long due to bad routing or pathing, I will lose this item. I do not want to lose this item or we are in trouble. We're going to go up the stairs. We're going to be real tight with our movement. Hopefully we'll be fine. I'm going to unequip right here. Okay, we didn't lose the item. That's good. <laughs> 
I believe we should be good for a fight. Yes, we are. I found the intruder. Stay put. Don't move. To the ruler. How about that? Don't you know? Don't you know me? It's me, Kotetsu. Welcome, Rob. Hope you're doing well. Also, hope you're doing better, Chris. Sorry it's hot near you currently. <clears throat> Did you find Mint? She's on board the ship. Chang's around. My business will drop off. You see her. Tell her to go back to the ship. The princess is the next floor prison. You saw the red door. There are red, yellow, and blue doors. Each has a password. Fortunately, we do not need to write these down. That, that was something growing up I got real concerned real quick. I would be like, I am not going to keep track of these without a, a paper. I know the red password, I'll tell you. I think you learned the red password. Well, do your best. I have to find her. What a bother. So, funny enough... You can move even though he's, like, walking away, which is, I think, the only time in the game that you can move when an AI is also moving as part of a cutscene. If you beat him out of the room, you don't learn the password. So, I, you, you can replay the cutscene because it technically doesn't trigger, but it is kind of funny. Uh... Okay. Three quit vanish. So we're going to go through the red door that's immediately up here. Ooh, I don't like my movement through there. I think I'll save time if I equip relay here. It's the intruder that was announced. I'll take you to the ruler. Yeah, yeah. Perish. <laughs> right, chat? Die. <laughs> like, just... Just goodbye. You're not a fight to me anymore. So we'll step on the switch. And oh, hey, look who it is, chat. It's the princess. Look, mission accomplished. Mickey, I thought you came here to help me. I was scared, but I waited for you to come. Welcome in Parameter and Rob. Hope you're both doing well. Mickey, come here. I know the way out of here. <laughs> take you to the ruler in pieces basically yeah like see look, look how slow that movement is i gotta wait for this also chad are you ready for the dumbest plot twist i like how she's like i'll take you out of here and she goes somewhere you haven't been what a plot twist chad i wonder if this is a setup or something Vicky, this is the end good job really a good job Never be fooled by a fake. After coming this far, I'll take you to a suitable place. Take a break there. Actually, I don't think it really matters here. I guess it's long. Yeah, you know what? I have to vanish out of this room regardless. I know, what a twist. Oh, here it is. Oh, uh, shoot, is it double down? double down okay so there's invisible enemies here i don't want to bump into them i'm looking for something very specific here it is all right i'm gonna unequip for safety reasons because i don't want to lose the vanish uh let's see So I do need the relay, but I'd like a safer route here. Oh, and see, I messed up my route regardless. So I'm glad I did that. That would have been very costly. Now I think I need the relay. I can talk to her first, I think. Mickey, please do something about these mice. Take care of this woman. I say that to you. I can't get in my nest if she's there, squeak. There you go, chat. Squeak, squeak. What? There's a mouse hole? In they go, chat. I have a mouse hole. Where am I? It smells bad in here and they're mice. Well, this is this is not the time. I heard. Next target of the fortress is Quintinex. My planet. We have to get out, but what to do? It's an elevator, but it's not moving. Alright, well time to turn into a mouse.
Uh, is there somebody to talk to in the middle path? Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Rob's saying I get why I played this game now. What a Rob. I can hit the switch. I'm just gonna safety unequip it. I, I did not like my movement through there. So I'm making sure to load into there to reset the timer, just so Chad is aware. I believe I gotta go straight up from here. I'm assuming I gotta go straight up from here. Oh, I hit an invisible enemy there. That was interesting. matters what I equip here. So we just needed to activate the elevator for chat clarity, so we hit the switch. It was that simple. Although, I like how she says, like, the elevator's not working. She didn't tell us where the elevator was, by the way. So, I mean, I guess if you checked it out the first time you were coming out, maybe you could have guessed this was the elevator. I mean, there were, like, three other doors there just for chat clarity. Game's a little mean about that. Look, Mickey, the elevator's moving. Get in! can't stand a place with mice, sorry. And away she goes. Uh, we'll go to the third floor. So this place could be very confusing for the obvious reason there are multiple floors and there are also one-way doors, which I'm avoiding on purpose. So we are absolutely skipping all combat encounters if we could avoid it. Wow, that was bad luck. Oh, that is such bad luck. Come on. Okay, I, I gotta reset it. <laughs> they both just stopped me from running. That was so rude. I don't like how far apart these are getting. Something like this. Why? Right, I need to check which exit. <laughs> There's three. I need to know. Uh... I need more clarity. Let me pull up the map. As I said before, I do not want to take a wrong door here. I have to go to most of these doors. I think it's the bottom right. Yeah, it's the bottom right. Okay. And I gotta go down this way. I could get that item if I really wanted to. Oops. Sorry, I might have jumped ahead of my notes. Go left, blah, 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 blah. Oh, 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 I see what I gotta do first. Yeah, that's fine. Sorry, wrong direction. Right idea, wrong way. Fortunately, this doesn't cost us too much other than a little bit of time. Oops. But I swapped it there. We have to come back here, like, in one moment. Please get out of the way. They gotta go this way. And I believe straight up is where we gotta go. That looks correct. Uh-oh. I activated this in a cutscene. Is this gonna destroy Vanish? Don't come in here. I'm still cleaning. Y you! Uh, 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 I... Because of you, I have to do this. I... Okay, that's good. Wanna hear my hard luck story? I'm glad we didn't lose Vanish to a cutscene. That would have been really bad. I mean, I have a backup one, but... Anyway. Sure, we'll hear a story. And listen, when the fortress exploded, I barely got out of here. Came to the fortress. Because of... Quintinex, the Eternal Janitor, was my sentence. I was the hacker's leader. They invented a no-run program to keep me here. I run, my body hurts. You still won something, what? Looking for the princess? I don't care. Wait, it's all up to me. I clean the whole fortress. 
So my key opens everything. Wahahaha. <laughs> you want it? The no-run program stops. I'll give it to you. Yellow password will, will be yours. It'll be easier for you to get around. This is what we needed. I think he learned the yellow password. Most sympathetic character, says Rob. Something like that. The program's in the fortress's computer. Y if you understand. Go, go if you understand. Do you care about the princess? Not really, but we're advancing the plot. Also, I feel sad every single time I move these items and they get so mixed up. Alright, so now I'm gonna go back to where I was before. I didn't have the password yet. It's fine. Uh... I did not mean to do that. That sucked. I'll take that, though. So, let's gear up. There you go, chat. Time to go into cyberspace. We're living the 90s dream again. Uh, let's see. I don't think there's many choices to make here, fortunately. I probably should have saved before coming here, honestly. But we, we've committed now. Here you go, chat. It's the Bug Bug rematch you've all been waiting for. We meet again. Dr. G increased my memory and gave me a power-up. What? The no-run program? Yeah, I have one. That's not so easy. If you want it, you'll have to beat me. Today is coming to test the speed chip and the speed management program. Here we go, chat. Look at Bug Bug living its Bug Bug life. As I'm about to punch it in its Bug Bug face. So I think I'm out of range, right? Oh, like by a pixel. He has, like, basically no chance of hitting me. Although he might confuse me, which is what he did there. So sadly... <laughs> We, 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 here's the RNG chat. Uh, oh, there we go. Hey, I got a back attack. Wasn't expecting that. So he has 2,400 health and an 87.5% damage reduction versus run attack. We really need a crit. Game, please. No bug bug wins. Wow. Rob rooting against me. What a Rob. Wow, he went full screen on that one. That sucks. I'm gonna guard. Make him go forward. Look at him operating his little device. He's so happy, chat. Oh my gosh. Hold on, chat. We're three in a row. How many times will I miss crit? Wow, four, four times in a row, missed the crit. This is so sad. I'll even attack from the front. I don't care, we just need to hit him once. I'm so sad, chat, five times. Six times. Welcome to where we're gonna be spending 10 minutes as the game refuses to crit. I'd like to remind everybody we have a 25% chance of critting as we go on our eighth one in a row without seeing a single crit. Just like to remind everybody. Nine times in a row. Are we gonna break, break our record of 14? We don't need to crit him that often. We need three crits, I think, total. Oh, there we go. There's one. It rolled high, so that's good. in the middle and block. He's only confused us once, so that's... Our, our confused dodge chance looks okay, at least. Really like a back attack crit here, though. 
All right, so we got um. Oh no, we got confused. I spoke about it. Rang some gold says Calvisham. Welcome, Calvisham. If our robot walks up and attacks them, I'd be so happy. I don't think we're gonna get that lucky though. We need two more crits, and the fight's over. If we could crit. <laughs> if we could crit. I'm mashing to refill that fuel gauge still, by the way. You're wondering why it's charging so quickly? I'm mashing. Holy game, please. I think we're at four. I don't think Bug Bug can physically damage me, by the way. I think I'm so tanky that even with 3 HP total, he can't kill me. There's our second crit. We need one more. The fight's over. A nice back attack here would feel good. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that third one was more merciful than the first two. Got 40 megs of experience, hit level 23. Perfect. Um, I could heal if I want to. I don't technically need this energy total. So I could have waited because I don't... I don't... Yeah, I don't technically need to do this. I could have reduced the menu here. But oh well, more spare HP in case things go wrong. Yeah, so we're good here. Bagu, Bagu. I can't manage. Bagu. Oh, we murdered. We murdered Bug Bug chat. Rip Bug Bug. There's actually very little of the game left to do at this point. There are only two bosses, and both of them are the final boss, uh, basically. So we need that key. I'm just gonna go out the way I came. We gotta go back to Blackmore, who is on permanent toilet duty, according to the game. <sighs> oh my gosh, the, R the RNG, please. Holy. They're actually just better than me, chat. Straight, they're better than me. Make sure we don't lose it in a cutscene or something stupid. What? We destroyed the program. Good job, I can move around. Free at last. I didn't think you could do it. I'm a man too. I'll give you the key. You received the key. I'm tired of cleaning. No more. I'm getting out. Thanks. A little safety save. Oh can't save. No safety save, apparently. Well, let me confirm my route real quick, and then we'll move forward. I believe we gotta go south and then to the right. We're not that far from our first breakpoint, at least. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> well, good thing we vanish. Quit vanish, use the key, use the key. Uh, should probably put the sword back on him just in case. Mickey, Mickey, Gato brought you here too. It's big, full of people and interesting. 
With a fortress like this, you don't fear hackers. Huh? This is the hacker fortress? That means I was kidnapped. I hadn't noticed. There you go, chat. The brilliant one has been captured. I can't just sit still. Mickey, let's get out of here. I will follow you. Prince, you're through. Hey, Mickey, you say? Been a long time. You mean again after hundreds of years? The time slip sent the ship into the future, but it gave me the power to build this fortress. I'm impressed that you got this far, but this is the end. Kato said this is the hacker's fortress. You come too. Right, Tira. I really am the fortress's ruler. Ruler? Ah. So you're the ruler, or you're the hacker ruler. That's right, but don't worry. I won't hurt you. So I'm a hostage. That's awful. Step aside. And she shoves him out. There you go, chat. Ah. You did it again. The console's mad again. Outside was outer space. Kato is okay? <laughs> I don't think there's something quite right, right with the princess chat. This way, it's easy to get out. Nikki, let's go. So she just threw him into outer space, is what we just witnessed. Nikki, if you send for the ship, we could return to Choco. Alright. So if at any point we had died or had any other issues, this is like my last big break in the game before I go fight the final boss. We have to basically run around the fortress and place three devices that we're about to receive here in Choco. And that is the last of the routing in the entire game. Once we do this, it's final boss time. Princess, Mickey, you're safe. I'm so glad. Thank you so much, Mickey. Choco is grateful to you. It's not just because of Tira. Because of your scrap, we got some information. I know you're tired, but the chief has news. Please stop by. Thanks for your help. Have the robot scrap. There's something left in the memory. Shot some film. Take a look. Yato, what do you think you're doing? The Cetron tells you what to do? You want to know? I'll tell you. Look at this Tetron. Here we go, chat. Can you see? This is the fortress that will attack Choco in the future. This fortress has a powerful reactor. It can also be a barrier. This fortress won't stop with Choco, but will go on until it conquers every planet. <laughs> I guess the Tetron lies to him as we're about to destroy this place. Or whatever. Ito, such a frightful thing. Cookie will oppose it. This ship is leaving soon. I'll get to do research where people can't see it. Napoleon, after we leave here, I'll rebuild your memory. You'll be my assistant. No robot, I can't refuse you. I'll prepare for departure. You see, the boy looks like Rask is thwarting this plan. This film was shot in the fortress's engine room, its nerve center. Based on this, we started a secret weapon to destroy the engine room. When it's done, we can stop the fortress. This, Mickey, is all thanks to you. I'm going back to the lab to work on the secret weapon. See ya! Really, Mickey, you're strange. Why do you have such a thing? Now I can see a ray of hope, thank you. Okay, do they talk to me when I'm in mouse form? Okay, they do. Anyway, let's go to the lab. 
I don't need to be the mouse, I just find it funny. RNG, please. <laughs> he, he walked in the only position that would block me. I didn't think we'd get so much information from a scrap. The timing. A secret weapon is finished. <laughs> so Rob says I prefer you to be the mouse. It is funny. They kind of forgot to code to check if you're the mouse after we left the other place. So they don't seem to react to the most part if you're the mouse. We we did get photographed as the mouse though in the in the flashback slash pass area, which was kind of funny. Kind of an oversight on them, but you know, we'll, we'll take it. It'll stop the reactor. Let's call these things jars, okay? Why is the S in jars not pluralized? In the film of the engine room, there were three reactors with a jar in front of each of one. If the red, yellow, and blue jars are arranged in order, the engine will stop. So, Mickey, I need this. There are no materials for a ship on Choco. Mickey, you have a spaceship, I've heard. You've been in the fortress. Could you go there and set up the jars? I love a no way is an option. We'll say easy. Really, I'll give you the three jars. Red jar, blue jar, yellow jar. Hey, did you hear he's gonna go? Really? Then we don't have to go. Mickey, go get him. Mickey, if you'd refuse, we'd have to go. Thank you. So, so Mickey Mouse saving the day as usual. I would like to safety save at some point, just in case I get my routing wrong and die. <laughs> it would be nice if we could save the game. Let's save briefly. No, nope, can't save. Are you ready? I'll guide you. Well, Mickey, wait. I could go back and get more repairs. I think we'll be fine. 21 is a lot. If I can't win with 21, I am insanely unlucky. I'm just putting it that way. I only realistically need about 10 to 15. I have six more than I really need. Um, have you seen the room where I was arrested? Where I was arrested is a computer. A special password is needed to get in. Remember what Gato used. Mickey, to help you, I'll tell you what it is. Mickey learns the special password. Please take care. Come back safely. So let's spaceship and then save at the other place, maybe, then? Safety save time. How is it noisy? What? Chat, how? What do you mean? I'm in outer space. How is it noisy? Jeez, whatever. With the cyberjack. Well, I guess I'm gonna one-shot this. I did try to save two different times. I got very rudely denied. Your internet died. Sorry about that. Okay. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. In the, in the ship next to the computer, I can save, but I can't save in the friendly base or the exit of the dungeon. Whatever. Right, chat? Whatever. The jars are arranged red, yellow, blue. Vicky, stay calm. Persevere. I don't know how much the order actually matters. I mean, I have a route I'm going to be doing with it. Sure thing wrong. Sorry for pausing so much. I do really need to make sure I don't. Oh, come on. I do need to make sure I'm going the right way. Because that happened, I'm gonna do this just to refresh it. <clears throat> okay, so I think our goal is the upper right. I'm just confirming. I'm sorry, bottom right first.
Uh, I do have sword on because I think we do have a fight. I don't think it really matters what I put on here. Talk to Mint. Oh, Mouse, don't come near me. Mickey, you came to save me. You're reliable, not like some people we know. Who are you talking to? Soldiers were all around, but the rescue worked. Little bonus dialogue there if we talk to her first. No way, why am I involved in this? What are you two doing? Quick, run! What if they come? Uh-oh, chat. Blackmore has arrived. So believe it or not, chat, we're within about 20 minutes of hitting the final boss. Assuming, uh, Athen goes well. Blackmore says, like moths to a flame. That's what you are. Orders from the ruler. You straighten up, I'll forgive your mistakes. Do it, take those two. What are you doing? Stop that! Oh, I'm just unlucky. Uh-oh, chat. They've been captured. Don't worry. They're being taken to a spaceship so they can escape. It's strange. Listen. I've had it with this disgusting job. I thought I'd take over the world, but I failed. In the end, I wanted to get the ruler in trouble. I'll tell you the blue password. I needed to go to the back of the fortress. He can learn the blue password. Okay, now officially I don't think we'll get one Wade. I'm going. Going where? The wind has no destination. Oh, look at him. He got his cool one-liner as he walks away, chat. He's like the wind. Okay. I believe we gotta go to the upper right. Double checking. We should hit a blue door. Maybe we did. Uh, let's do a quick little swap a room. Alright, so we're just refreshing it here. So, unfortunately, you might have noticed before, the alarms in the game can still detect me, even though I have Vanish. And that also applies to lasers. So I'm probably going to trip it, unfortunately, at some point. Oh, oops. Since I messed that up, I'm just going to go reset this. I don't know what the timing is to avoid it, if chat is curious. I saw a buffer strap, but I didn't understand it. It involves some arbitrary movement, for the most part. Like, I go forward, I go back six- like, I walk forward, I move six tiles, then I go up, then I go down, then I go left, or something weird. I didn't understand it, so I'm just gonna keep it simple. So let's equip the jar. Set up the red jar. And this, that part is even with the chameleon glasses, I feel like even growing up, the lasers were just too fast for me. So it, it just didn't matter, sadly. We'll just go for it again. I believe we can safely equip the blue jar next. The question is, do I need to hit the switch? I think we do. Yes. I wish there isn't- is there a way to tell what direction this is aiming? I don't see a visual difference. It's kind of rude. Sadly, this part is like somewhat memorization. Oh, it's yellow first. 
My bad. Start the yellow. We inserted red, we inserted yellow. And I believe we gotta exit out the northeast. We just gotta get our way back here. I don't think I need to hit that computer switch. Oh, I did. No, one way. And a quick real quick, just to make sure we have enough timing with it. Unfortunately, we have not lost the Vanish, which is really good, because that'll make me very sad if that happens. I don't think that matters at all, because I'm going to go all the way over here. I refresh it. Yeah, I think we're good. Quick refresh. Everything should be destroyed, is what's happening here. Not too bad so far. Again, I hate that the vanishes just kind of end up like really deep in my inventory. Because it's very easy to accidentally put them at the bottom. Oh, I forgot to hit the switch. Uh... we haven't bumped into any invisible enemies yet i'm gonna be honest with you i'm surprised it hasn't happened uh, see i'm not sure if he causes a rust status ailment i'm assuming he doesn't i'm gonna put shield four on robot two for now So we, we managed to get everything done there. If we gotta go to the southwest. Oh, I bumped into invisible enemy there. That was, that was concerning to say the least. I'm glad it didn't trigger anything. Again, that would have been a very rude encounter. I probably would have died normally. We're gonna exit south. Gonna ignore the items because I literally don't need them anymore. We're gonna go west. Gonna try to squeeze our way through these places. Oh my gosh, game, please. We're gonna unequip this. We got kind of close of losing it, to be honest with you. It doesn't last for very long. Alright, so now that we're here, let's go to the fourth floor. We're gonna put our Vanish back on. Thank you, Vanish. You're making the end of the game go so much smoother. Could you imagine me trying to dodge all those enemies, chat? Be horrendous. I gotta go to the upper right of the two. Now the question is, do I go right here? No, I go left. What's my XP looking at? I need to be at approximately 510. I'm at 514. So I'm, that's pretty close, right, chat? I got on. I was pretty much there. I didn't. I don't have to do any additional fights. And we are officially at the first of the two final bosses. We'll save right here, chat. I wonder if I can mouse into. Well, I don't want to mouse into this cutscene because otherwise, I think I have to be forced to do this. Actually, no, no, no. I'm not forced right away. Let, let's 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 mouse. Oh, nobody. How come nobody could finish off this kid? He's not a normal kid, you know. Don't you? He has Rask's blood in his veins. Welcome back, Rob. Napoleon, why are you here? Hey, it's okay. You, you can't oppose me. You're a designer. I order you to do it. What happened? Do it now! Gato. No, Gato. I'm not who I was before. 
Choco scientists rebuilt me. Now I can ignore your orders. This fortress will be destroyed. Give up. What else is there to do? This is just one of my plans. You will soon see my real plan. Wait, are you escaping? Indeed. I'm leaving you here for now. Soon you'll be finished by my hand. We meet again. The Choco scientists rejuvenated me. Heard you were coming, so I followed you. Hey, this is no time to get sentimental. You could cross this, you could follow Kato. If there's only you, I can throw you across. I must do something about it. Can you stop him? We'll say, of course. I knew you'd say that. You don't know what's ahead. Are you ready? Yes. Good. I'm counting on you to get to get Kato. I'll hold this place. Mickey, you really look like Rask. <laughs> I think that's an insult to Rask. To look back at the screen and make sure um, something like that. Being with you is like being with him. Must believe in your creations. Use them well. Don't make the mistake of being like Kato. It'd be dangerous like that. You should go back to your original form. Hey, we got bonus dialogue. Hey, acknowledge the mouse. Well, there's no time to spare. Stand at the edge. He chucked the mouse. Well, unfortunately, I don't want to be the mouse in a boss fight or I'm going to die really quickly since I can't revive when that happens. Okay. So rudely, there's some more enemies between us and the destination. Oh, the, oh, invisible enemies, invisible enemies. I bumped into one randomly. Oh, that would have been so bad for us, chat. That would have been so bad. So funny enough, I think we can spaceship out of here still. I don't want to do that though, because I don't want to sit through that cutscene again. I forgot there was more enemies. I should have checked my notes. That was my fault. That wasn't the notes' fault. The notes did nothing wrong that time. And now we officially no longer need Vanish. Thank you, Vanish. What a brave boy. But what can you do now? <clears throat> Understand this machine? Inside Tetron are built in. Uh-oh, chat. Did I switch to sword? Or fi Do I sword or fist? I might have made a mistake. I forgot to check. <clears throat> Tetron only shows the future, but this machine is different. When it's finished, I'll rule time. And I'll be rid of you forever. If it's sword, I gotta restart. Hope I switched. I did not switch. My bad, chat. Quick little reset here. This is why we safety save. I fixed I fixed Robot Buddy 2. I did not fix Robot Buddy 1. My bad. That would have been a very long and slow fight. I don't think I can swap my equipment mid-battle, or else I would just do that. But anyway, I'm just gonna mash through. Cutscene is intended, sadly. I guess I could save after this conversation, just in case something goes wrong. But I'm expecting to die maybe a couple of times here, but not super often. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we're right at the end. We have to fight Kato and then the real final boss. Oh, I actually, I actually hit cancel, but I think it buffered my input there. That sucks. That sucks. I was hitting A, 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 then I went B, and then it was like, no, I hit A one too many times. Um, this is probably still fine. I guess I could save here. Give me a hint. Oh, your hints suck. Come on, we'll save here. We got fists equipped, let's just go forward. So at this point, I don't really need Vanish again, so I could just wear it until the end. I bumped into the invisible enemy twice there. Oh my gosh, where where was that other one? I'm getting actually trolled. I'm gonna swap Vanish to Vanish. I'm curious if that does anything.
Oh, that was pretty. That was pretty smooth. All right, so let's try this again. We managed to not lose our vanish at all, but we have two boss fights to do, and then we're done with the game. Let's go to roughly the middle of the screen and then block. They disabled my run command. That is really rude. Uh, at least we're doing 100 damage instead of 20. I think chat could agree that is a big improvement. Well, can I reach him for the back attack here? I'm not sure, this might not be close enough. Oh, it is. Sadly, I got disabled, or else that would have been big damage for us. I'm gonna choose to guard here. There we go, we got a nice juicy back, back attack, which would have been nice to run command. Game is rude. Enemy design this game is top notch. Glad you're enjoying it, Rob. Sadly, we got Flurry again, but not in a way that was useful for us. Ooh, he actually hit me there. One repair down. Ooh, so fast. Do something like this. Back attack here doesn't matter. We only care about the boss's damage. Got disabled again. That's not good. We need to not get disabled. We're not getting crits, but nothing nothing has changed here. We blocked it this time. Do something like this to manipulate him. Let's end their turn like here-ish. If this is good enough. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Manipulation. That forced him to have a, his back turned. There we go, there's a crit. I'm hoping to not use too many revives here, but we'll see what happens. You know what? I'm gonna choose the guard here. Make him go closer to me. I think we need the back attack more than I need. How are we always getting disabled right as I get the back attack? That is incredibly unlucky, Chad. I would just like to state. It is incredibly unlucky. Alright, there's another crit. We don't need that many of them. I think two more and he dies. Although at this point we're gonna do enough minimum damage, we might be fine. Ooh, I was so worried he was gonna get a turn. Disabled again when we get the back attack. So sad, chat. Please stop disabling my run command. This might kill me. Ooh, dodged. Right, we're gonna guard, force him to teleport behind us. Please do not disable my run command. Come on. <laughs> the words unlucky don't even begin to describe what is happening right now. We have, like, a pretty good chance of not being run commanded. I'm pretty sure at worst it's a 50-50, but we have gotten it almost every single time. There we go, fight over. So we only use one revive, that's fine. Increase by 90 megs of data. We hit level 25. You gained a level. Yeah, we gained more than that. So the rest of this is gonna go purely towards energy. Let's go ahead and repair. So we're looking good for the end of the game. We're only like 12 levels under the recommended level. <laughs> right, Chad? Just, just only 12. <laughs> I mean, like, we should pr it in the non in a non strategy version. I probably shouldn't enter with less than 100, but uh, we're going to be doing something very specific. So we are still likely to die almost instantly, but we'll do our best, I guess. I think we're good here. I have 20 repairs. 
There's nothing I could really do with our remaining items. I mean, I could combine Scrap 3 and Scrap 7 if I want to, just to see what the combo is. Or maybe not. And make Big Bomb. I don't feel like making Big Bomb, though. I guess we'll end our turn here. Now, am I allowed to save from here? We'll find out. Pretty good. Interesting. So, have any bravado left? Follow me. Go into the machine. I'll show you something. Saving. Actually, I did that in the slightly wrong order. So, I mentioned earlier there's a bug with the game. We're gonna try to abuse it a little bit. I'm gonna see if this is good enough. I'm not sure if the, if he causes rust status ailment. If he does, I'll reset the fight. We'll learn on the fly, because I, I don't know what attacks this boss has in terms of status ailments, other than disable run. So, I mentioned earlier, there's a bug with shield 4. So instead of it halving elemental damage, it reduces damage dealt by two elemental attacks from the final boss to single digit damage. So that 33 HP is actually somewhat relevant. So I can tank maybe three or four hits. Actually, more like four or five hits, which is uh, a lot more chances and a lot less repairs. I have a couple safety cures to use on Hit Me. So we have two more than I technically need for the fight. So I'm hoping that this will be good enough. So we're gonna go make sure we're fist. I could have built like another shield pack, I guess, with my bonus money. If I really wanted to be safer, that would have made hit me basically immortal. But uh, we'll we'll try this and see how it goes. Let's step into the machine chat. Nikki, I was listening. You plan to follow Gato. It's useless to stop you. Go out on your own. Going out on your own unsettled you, but now you found your way. You don't know what's ahead. Want to save? Oh, automatic save. Save. Well, Mickey, your father and I like you a lot. I'm sure you're important to your friends, so be careful. Go for broke. <laughs> she fighting game praised us there. Well, time to go into the machine chat. Let's go. Final boss time. This final boss has 5,200 HP. So it has way more than anything we've fought so far. Welcome to the space background. They love this in Quintet. You ever played Act Razor, Terra Enigma, Illusion of Gaia? Inevitably, there will be... Little swirly backgrounds everywhere. Look at me, he's smiling, he understands me. Dear, he can't see anything yet. Right, but I have to name this child. What are you talking about? I know what you think. You're right. Mickey, how's that? Mickey, a good name. Good. Mickey, a present from your father. Mickey, be healthy. I'll always watch over you. Cannot run faster than what we're doing. I am holding the run button for clarity. Oh, there's Rask. Gato, thought I'd pass this Tetron on. Why do you want to see the future? This invention is not good for people. You're not greedy, Rask. Why don't you use it? You know the future. You could be a hero. You throw the Tetron away, I could use it. What do you think, Rask? Gato, what are you thinking? Mass looks less mass like than I was expecting. Yeah, based off the earlier conversation, you would have thought. Wait, Rask, don't you want to go back to Choco? There are Tetron all over this planet. Researchers could come here from Choco. Sorry, Cookie. I knew from looking at the Tetron. Tetron would be would be that way on this planet. But I wanted to come here. There's a dream here. Choco has no dreams. No matter how long, I'll keep looking. It's not the only reason. I'll explain it on Choco, but I won't forget about Tetron and you. There you go. The many phases of Gato here. In the flow of time, humans just exist like the things they make. They too will fade and be forgotten. I thought inventions would exceed human power. Tetron gave me the opportunity. 
So I got the power to control time. Now I'll control the fate of humans. It's easy to erase you with my own hand. This is a sign to Rask, maker of the Tetron. Here we go, chat. Gato's final form. It's looking a little more, um, robot -y. Come on, crits. The great crit fest chat, here it comes. I need to hit him 52 times or crit him like four times. Oh no, crit him like six times. So at least we have a guaranteed clock. I cannot be here much longer than 52 turns. Oh, there we go. There's the bug kicking in. So that's good luck. He did an attack we can resist. He can also resist that attack, potentially. So good luck so far, chat. Nice. I think this is also good. Oh, no, I don't know what it is now. Uh, this might be bad. If it's bombs, it's bad. Uh, we pro Oh, we didn't die. We'll take it. We're going in, chat. <laughs> I'm mashing the buttons. Oh, we died. Rip. Well, this is why we have repairs. We managed to get, like... We did manage to get, like, five attacks in before we died. So if we average that, we should be fine. Please use an attack I can block. Big bomb again. I mean, we, we have a dodge chance with it. It's not guaranteed, but I don't want to see that one. Come on, crits. We need crits. Ooh, I barely got the turn, mashing it out. That could have been much worse. Reminds me of an elephant, something like that. I think we resist this one. If it's fire, we're fine. Yeah, this is fine. This is another attack that doesn't matter for us. Okay, we got a crit. That's good. So we got an average of about eight strikes on him because crits count for six, it looks like. We need to do 52 total hits. Crits save a lot of time. I don't think we'll crit very often. But that's huge for us. We did this attack again. Oh, that is... This boss is pure RNG, if you can't tell, chat. There's no pattern to this. We just gotta believe that we're gonna outcrit him. Okay, didn't crit, but that's fine. We also dodged that attack. That's really good. Ooh. The button mash to make sure I don't lose a turn there is insane. I really prefer him to stop doing that attack. That one has a pretty good chance of hitting us. But so far we're doing well. We've gotten almost 10 attacks in a row on one repair. We're looking pretty good. There's one other attack I think we can resist. It might be this one. I think it's this one. Nice. So that's good luck. So we're getting crazy amounts of hit right now on this character. I'm loving this chat. I'm loving this. <laughs> RNG is not perfect, but we're getting a million hits in without him hitting us here. Listen, chat, if he fails five times in a row, I'll take this. Ooh, another crit? Oh, that's huge. So that means at least a fifth of his health is gone. Probably like a quarter if you add up all the other hits. Just need just a few more crits. Ooh, an attack that only does one damage. That's perfect. So yeah, this, this life put in the work, chat. That life put in the work. <laughs> so even if we die like immediately here, it doesn't matter. Okay, we, need, we want to see fire meteors or ice meteors. We don't want to see his other attacks, generally speaking. Oh, I heard the block sound effect. Maybe we live? No. One of them got through. That's unfortunate. Unfortunate chat. 
Well, we have a lot of repairs. We just need to hopefully get some attacks in. So I think that kind of still averages out to one in five. So even if we only get an attack in every five hits or so, that's completely fine. Did he seriously confuse me? Wow. Wow. That's really unlucky. I don't... I think this one will kill us, our back is turned. I don't think we'll block. I think we'll... I don't think we'll dodge. That is pretty bad luck. But we dodged it. Do I reach the boss from here, though? Guess I'll find out in a moment. No. Super unfortunate. I wasn't sure how far down he went. And we got one strike on him. I am mashing that fuel gauge refill. So we're, we're, we're bringing the average back up to about six. We strike him one more time, I think we're in a good place without dying. Okay, I think we're in a good place now. Oh, we went twice because I didn't mash fast enough, but we blocked. Okay, that's good. Man, I really got to mash that final part out. Okay, this is good. I think we're stabilizing. Oh, the crit is huge. The crit by itself makes up for any other whiffs we have on the other lives. So this is really good. I think we've gotten four crits. So he's below half health at this point. Oh, another crit. Oh, this is huge. We might be on his final quarter of health. So just from crits alone, we've half health him. But we did get in at least 16 other hits. And if this crits again, he's going to be dangerously low. Oh, dangerously low, chat. Let's go. Come on, another crit. <laughs> you can do it. End the fight here. Yeah! Back-to-back -back crits. GG. Got him. <laughs> that, that, was a, that was a good boss fight. Right at the end. It got a little mix in between with the confuse. Make it increase by zero megs of data. GG. Game's over. Gehabra says, Mickey's a hurry. Mickey crisis. I'm all right, doctor. Mickey's doing well. Doctor, you're biased. Not, not like that, but anyway, let's go. No kidding. We escaped from there. Why aren't we going back? You don't have to go. I smell a scoop. I've got to go. Whose spaceship do you think you're on? Or using, excuse me. What a whiner. Hurry, or we'll lose the scoop. What a woman. What is the smell of a scoop? There you go, chat. We're just walking in the star field. I like how it looks afterwards. Mickey, what are you doing? What? Did you get the hacker's boss? I'm impressed. You could do anything if you try. I thought you were unreliable. <laughs> wow, filling us with confidence right at the end of the game. Mickey, you're safe. I'm so glad. Wait, how did she get here? Good job. I'm happy, Mickey. A great scoop. Headline, Rococo Boy Saves World. How about that? Wow. 
Are you really a reporter? That Katetsu. Did father just have a spaceship all this time and didn't tell us? Nikki, good job. Your ancestors are happy too. Ito got a power that people can't handle. The user gives life to an invention. Used well, it does good. Misused, it does evil. Tetron is a puzzle between the mind of the maker and the mind of the user. There you go, chat. Your last minute philosophy statements. The flow of time will cover us. We must escape. Ah, yes. Darn that flow of time, chat. Wait. What are you doing? Just hurry. But... The... That... Tetron? Was it a waste? The Tetron? Yes. It's best to leave it alone. It's been laid to rest. He fell into a deep, deep sleep. There we go. It's never quite the 90s until something explodes. <laughs> That's like 90s lol, chat. Like, you're in a final base, final boss, they better explode. We even went to cyberspace, too. That's very 90s. Bonus points if it's a kid that does it. So, I don't recall if there's anything after the credits. It has been a long time since I've beaten the game. We return to Quinton X, aka definitely not Earth. The end. Oh. Oh, is there... Is that it? Okay. Well, we'll give it a minute, just in case. But hey, GG, I guess. Oh, well, look, it's doing something. I was gonna say, we need the staff roll at some point. Oh, Red Robot, we recolored too. What, what are the squid things? What? <laughs> wow, it, it went full Japan. <laughs> Smite original colors. They, they got the banners, the, the hanging lanterns. I guess that's what that was supposed to be on the on the floor, but I didn't know what those were right away. Now that I see it in context. Bushoi. Yeah, the paper lanterns. Oh, Carl's dad's back. I guess we saved the lovers, question mark? So maybe we're seeing their bonus ending here? I don't know if the ending actually changes, depending on if you do the quest or not. We technically did nothing to save the old woman. <laughs> we, we technically skipped her, but we brought her family back together, so I guess that works. Oh, look at the little skulls everywhere. Monster designer, Sado Kabayashi. Oh, there's the pumpkin heads. There you go, the witch's hat. Is that squid on a stick? What was that? <laughs> Rip Franken, we avoided encounters with you. You would have been horrendous for us. An enemy with resistance to lightning and potentially run command is a very bad matchup when we're using lightning sword only. Rip 
Chris in the chat saying, probably squid on a stick, or is one of the skewers they haven't known? It had like a squid-esque shape. <laughs> what it reminded me of. Well, I guess we saved the village here. They're doing the praise dance, chat. So when we're done with the credits, we'll give our final thoughts. But we'll, we'll let them play out for now. Wait, how did all three children get here? Are they vacationing or something? Oh, there we go. The shaman got unmasked. I still don't know what those things are supposed to be. Are they like dog faces? Like, how would you describe those statues, chat? It kind of reminds me of a dog without the ears. I don't know what they're supposed to be. Like, I can imagine big floppy ears on that statue. Easy. Rob saying headless women. Hopefully not. <laughs> oh, they're feeding the mice now. Yeah, I like the dog theory better. Oh, they destroyed their own lab again. Oh, they got minied. Oh, we never got a shrink thing other than the mouse thing. Unless the Church of Mouse was started, praise Mickey. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, we got our... St well, they owed us the statue. They told us there would be a statue in our honor. And we could have said all, all hail slash all praise Lord Mickey. So I'll give it this. At least the ending cutscene is like... I don't like to use the word cute, but it's cute. I, I don't really like cute, but I understand people that like that kind of stuff appreciate it. It's nice to see like what they're doing. So I'll give it that. We've, we've seen some very lackluster credits before. In particular from Quintet. The cyberspace people are lost yet again. Just go left. Go left. There's like two paths in cyberspace. You can make it. Oh, Bug Bug is back. Is he being sacrificed to Bug Bug? What's going on there? There you go, Chad. Bug Bug lives. It's a good ending. Chicken on the roof for some reason. I guess this is the chicken house. Like how he decorated, but nobody could really reach him. <laughs> or at least nobody would have a reason to go to his house. Oh, there's Einst. The mayor in Blackmore. I guess he escaped the island, question mark, even though I didn't help him. Wow, they stole all of his chickens. He lives for the chicken chat. His life is over, essentially. He got the bad ending. Spaceship. Wait, Gato lived? What? Thanks for playing Mickey right at the end. Wait, how did Gato live? I, I guess the explosion wasn't that serious.
Quintet, Ancient, and Enix. There you go. What a team. 1994 copyright chat. There you go. This feels pretty final. And away they go, chat. And. So now I'm assuming for real, for real, it is over. <laughs> I'm hitting start, hitting the buttons, nothing happens. A good time. We'll give it a couple more seconds. Then we'll talk about how we feel the session went into our final thoughts. Yeah, something tells me. I think we're done. Go to Let's Chat. <laughs> Rip the game. Uh, let's back up the soundtrack slightly. So how do we feel the session went overall? Um, I think I just had like one routing mistake. Obviously, you know, movement can be cleaner if I ever want to speedrun this seriously. But from the standpoint of completing the game, we had horrible, horrible, horrible RNG with uh, Bug Bug. Um, and the fight before that Rose was the worst RNG in the previous session. However, I think the final boss actually went pretty well. We only revived, I think, four times between two of the bosses that involved Gatel. I think that's fine. That's completely fine. Listen, we had 20 repairs. I was ready to cure our other robot to bring him up to 180. Final boss list of a threat. Yeah, Bug Bug took forever. Like, seriously. Rose and Bug Bug took forever. Like, it was crazy. The stall on Bug Bug was unreal. Yeah, we avoided all of the encounters in the final dungeon. If you're wondering why it went so much faster, Vanish is really, really overpowered. So if you're looking to play more of a casual standpoint, definitely uh, get early Vanish if you can. And then just constantly swap in and out Vanish. We ended up literally only 4 XP over the target goal. So that means I only fought maybe at most one extra encounter that I needed. Otherwise, we followed the same level XP route that, uh... Basically, the speedruns have done. So we, we did pretty minimal levels. I mean, we beat that at, like, what, 25? Instead of being, like, level 40, level 50, level 80. That was pretty good. Just keep in mind, <laughs> keep in mind, chat, like, we were not even remotely close to unlocking all those options. So the game definitely expected you to have, like, 90 plus HP from pure levels, and then also movement and everything else. So, oh well, didn't need it. <laughs> right, chat? Did not need it. So I don't really have too much else to add. I, I think overall, the final dungeon is kind of cruel with a lot of its switches and one ways. I made it look a bit easier because I literally had the map and or the route in front of me in the notes. But any one of those doors could have booted us out, and I could have had to have gone through the entire dungeon again, basically start to finish, because I'll be at a point where I have to go back down a floor to go up a floor kind of situation. So I'm not a fan of the final area overall. I think once you have all the passwords, it's not too bad. Yeah, that's why I was that's why I paused a couple times, because I was like, listen. Yeah, I will lose like six to eight minutes if I take a wrong door. Pausing for like 20 seconds is preferable if I'm really not sure. So we managed to dodge all of that, fortunately. I did not go backwards by accident. So at least there's that. The, the worst that happened is I went to the yellow door early and that was like really easy to fix. So I think from that standpoint, I'm happy with how I guess the today's session went, but I think we'll be saying goodbye to YouTube as we move on to the final thoughts in just a moment. So if you did watch at this point in the video of the bond, I'd like to say thank you for watching. Hope to see you again next time.